My name is Georgina, I'm a sales executive at MediaFleet. MediaFleet are a business to business provider of uh, vehicle fleet livery and branding. Companies with uh, large commercial vehicle fleets and medium sized commercial vehicle fleets can come to us uh, for all of their branding and livery requirements. Project sales of about four to five million uh, this year. Um, we are growing, we currently employ 25 people. So Media Fleet operates UK nationwide. We can have anywhere between two and 15 um, vehicle installers out on site at any one time. Communication within Media Fleet is vital uh, for a number of reasons. Our um, schedules for our fitting is continually changing, uh, dependent upon customer requirements at the time. Often their deadlines move or uh, vehicles change uh, places within the country, etc. So we need to keep in touch with our fitters who are out on site all of the time. We'd had um, a great deal of experience with O2. They've been providing our mobile phones for some years now and we've, we've been very impressed with the levels of service that they've provided. My account manager at O2 came forward to me with a proposal for the landlines which um, at first glance was clear to see there was going to be some cost savings for Media Fleet, which obviously is always attractive um, to a company but it's not just that for us, it's definitely the level of customer service that we receive uh, and when it came to the actual day of the switchover it was completely seamless. Nobody even knew that it had happened. It just happened uh, as if by magic. So yeah, it's fantastic. We're saving about £500 a month, which is definitely a valuable saving. Certainly if the accounts department were here, they would say that that's much easier for them because obviously they have uh, one bill coming in for both. Um, and it's something that is, you know helps with the filing and all that sort of thing. We've got all of our uh, vinyl installers on smartphones now where they can email artwork specifications um, which often change last minute um, so there's less errors in that way you know, we don't then have to fit something which is actually incorrect. The experience that we've had with O2 so far has been uh, a very good one certainly if there was any call for any additional services to be added O2 would be my first port of call.